Take me to Candyland. Ooh, take me to Candyland. Sweeter than sugar, you doing that dancey dance. Good. Oh, good morning, everybody, and welcome back to Arizona. Today, I am pursuing a second attempt to make the cut here at Agent Ong and I'm gonna need to go about even. So even plus I have 30 pins for being a woman, I guess. It's five pins a game for six games. So that's nice and that's helpful, but I gotta do it on my own first. So, oh my God, my skin's on my hair. I'm sorry. But yeah, so gonna have Ari and Jess come and watch and Ari's gonna help ball rep and take some videos of me bowling because y'all have been complaining that you can't or you haven't seen any of my shots so we're gonna make that happen and yeah i'm excited to bowl and just gonna take it one shot at a time and enjoy myself i'm going to have fun i'm going to have fun and i'm gonna carry everything and make all my spares and then the next vlog will be tomorrow when they cut to the top however many so yes um, I guess I can either, I'll put a link in the bio where you can follow scores and the live stream. And this is where the scores are at. This is the scores going into the next, um, uh, squad. And there's two squads today plus a Desperado. It's a hundred dollars, just two games though. So yeah, I might bowl that, but we're going to say I'm not going to have to. That's what we're doing, and let's get to the bowl. It's 12.22, we're about 20 minutes from the bowling alley, and still at the house. So this is just how I like it, get there an, enough time to, you know, get my shoes on, throw a couple shots of practice, and just get on with it. So this is good, we got some Portillo's, so I'm gonna eat that um, when we start, and life is good. You see the palm trees? Now. Okay, and the title of this video is going to be I led my squad at Agent Ong. Okay, okay, I hope so. Fingers crossed. See you at the bowling alley. The team's putting in the work for me. Thank you, Ari. Say hi. <laughs> Good morning, everybody. So let's just start this video with that alley down there, this little alley. I went down there and cried last night for about 30 minutes because this video is not going to be titled, I led my squad at Agent Ung, whatever. It's gonna be, I lost in a roll off to not make it to the finals of Agent Ong. So let's just recap real quick because I was not on my phone. I was very focused yesterday and just trying to, you know, bowl well. So um, I bowled, I ended up bowling three squads, three qualifying squads, which like when you're in that deep, you have to bowl the Desperado, you know? Like even after two, I was, after not making it, I was like, I'm bowling a third. Like, okay, four might've been pushing it, unless you count the Desperado, but Bold three, um, the last squad, I tried to put some more surface on my stuff and it just wasn't it. But the second squad was pretty good. I went like 50 under and you know those 30 bonus pins we were talking about? I don't get them. I don't get them because I bowl on Team Canada. So not that it had any effect, but I ended up, yeah, it was minus 50 the second squad and then like minus 100 and a lot the third squad. So then on the burn, I start getting a good look. So I'm like, you know what? Let's bowl this Desperado. And then uh, 208, clean 208, the first game, just a two game, $100 Desperado 
one in eight make it. There was 20 bowlers or 18 bowlers. So two people made it. And then the second game, I have the front eight. And I'm like, oh, bet. And then ninth frame, wrap 10, miss it. And then 10th frame, strike 7-2 or something. And I end up missing the lead by 10 pins, I think it was. And I tie. I tie with this other guy. Oh, there's a bug. And we bowl a ninth and 10th frame roll off. And I lost. I went strike, nine pin, spare, seven. And he went strike, spare, strike. So I lost by three pins in that, and it was really disheartening. I'll put that clip in now. But I, I can tell you with all my years on the different tours, bold, different bowlers have different philosophies towards that. Um, and she lofts it, try to get over the hook spot, Bang. and she does. Um, you know, some people like to have the ball in their hand, uh, and, and in this case, I believe Garrett chose to start first. I think that's how it went down. But some players like to finish first and post it, and then others do like to have the ball in their hand. Um, again, everyone's different. There's no, uh, you know, philosophy, advantage, psyche. Um, you can spin it a bunch of different ways, but um, everyone sees it a little bit different. <clears throat> Classic. Pretty good. Needs. Pretty good. All right. All right. All right. Four pin goes in front of the nine. And again, I want to I step back to her first shot, um, which was over here on lane 10, which we just were talking about, that hook spot. Um, and again, we've already had, what, eight games? Converts the spare, um, and she saw that in her prep, her warm-up shot, and she made it a point to loft it over that spot. And so it'll be interesting to see. That was a smart play for sure, and it'll be interesting to see what Garrett comes up with. You know, his his shot over there did strike, but yep. if he touches that spot quick, it's gonna yeah, it will any, anything's possible. Count important here. Count was very important there. Mm -hmm. Here it's got some pins to work with. This could be for the dub. It's a little wide. Oh. Mm. At 10.30. Sarah Class watching dead on. Strail needs eight. Has it's 10. ten. And that Garrett Strail is your advancer. Is going to advance to tomorrow's Cashers round, along with Josh Anthony from the Desperado squad. And yeah, it was just really upsetting because I felt like I bowled so good, and you know, having front eight and giving yourself a chance and then missing, it's just like, come on now. But whatever, we're back here today. I'm gonna support. The Family Ties members that made it on, they're going to bowl four games and then cut to the 24, or top 24. So that's what we're doing. Still on the same pattern and everything. But, yeah, going to cut to top 24 and then we'll just go from there. But I do fly out at 4 today, so I'll have to leave a little early. But I'm still excited to catch some of the action. So thank you for being here and let's go watch some bowling. Here we go. I'm going to do some commentating today, too, since I'm actually not on the lane. So let's get going. So fun fact, this is who won the Desperado last night. He beat me by about 10 pins. So that was
Great shot. Great shot. Start match play. Top 24 minus the top 8 because the top 8 got 85. Riley came out of retirement. <laughs> Agent on the
flying today oh my gosh the zipper broke so it's not shut but it's duct tape 